Hello Superherd and welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. In the last episode we won 100% in Cascade Kingdom and today we're moving on to the Sand Kingdom. Let's go! Okay, so we're gonna deposit the, it looks like 19 moons we got. We need 144 more until we're at 500. It's gonna be a little bit lower now. So yeah, it didn't take us too long to 100% Cascade Kingdom. A lot of it was quite easy and just sort of handed it to it to us. So new products are added to the shop. I'm going to assume that's probably, I'm going the wrong way, Wario's clothes. Um, Cause we got his hat last episode as well. But yeah, now this one might even take more than one episode to complete. It is the Sand Kingdom. It seems like there's so much to do here, which is just crazy to me. So let's go ahead and get started with it. So here we are. Now the moon isn't too far away from the spawn. It's way over there. Hmm. The moon rock is glowing here too. Let's be sure to check that. Yep, every time it's gonna say that. Fine with me, fine with me. Because it will open up a ton of things that we'll be doing every single time. So let's get to it. It's way over here. I'm just gonna waggle the controller. Oh boy. Hey, look at that. There's some guys from other kingdoms here too. We got the, um, where are they? They're uh, walruses from the the frozen snow kingdom or whatever. And we'll check that out soon. But first, we have a big old rock of moon that will fly into... Okay, this takes longer than I thought. The sky! <laughs> okay, cool. It's always so beautiful. I like looking at it. And I like wiggling my screen. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm wiggling all over the place. Let's see what we can do with that. So this game actually has been taking longer to 100% than I originally would have expected. It's a huge game, but there is stuff everywhere. And I would like to see how large that inflates the moon count. It gets it all the way to 89 instead of, I think it was 69 before. So we got lots and lots to do everywhere, but you can even see a lot of the stuff we have completed in this area. It's, it's quite expansive for sure. And I just don't even know where to start. Like I said, there's so much to do in so many different places that we should start probably way back at the beginning. It looks like there is some stuff to do. We got ourselves a little moon pipe. Let's go. And then we still have plenty of purple coins to find as well. Like that might be a bit of a challenge. I'm sure to have missed a couple purple coins because I'm just really, I feel like I'm just, I, I do better now than I used to when it comes to exploring this game than I was when we first explored the Sand Kingdom. What is with that platform down there? Oh, that's the key, huh? Okay, let's plop down, and maybe if we plop down on this, it'll start moving, it will. So this is probably how we find the first of the two moons. All right, give it to me. Yeah! Okay, so there you go, I forgot the moons were green. I'm like, wait, was that? Uh, and then it was, okay, cool. So let's get up there. All the way up, all the way up, mm, all the way up, yeah. Okay, so I can do that. Jump onto the transparent lift. I forgot it was even transparent. I was just sort of getting used to walking this slow. All right, go, go, go. Okay, oh, oh, that was a little close. So we gotta make our way all the way through. That's actually pretty crazy. Oh gosh, probably shouldn't do it that recklessly. Oh gosh, I don't know how much I like this either. Whoa, we almost walked right off. Hmm, so if I go this way, which is a little bit more risky and harder to do, I can get some extra coins for it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> That's easy. Okay, maybe not as much as I thought. Oh, got it. Okay, so I actually wanna stay to the left here. I think it's faster, oh gosh. You just move, you move so darn slow. Go, 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 go. It's just, it's hard enough not knowing where these platforms are. It makes it even harder that uh, the platform is so thin. All right, so I mean, in all technicality, I could have just not done it with the Moai head. It just would have been more confusing and more difficult where the transparent platforms end. So I think that's gonna be all the two we get in here. We have a lot to find. Like, what are we even at? That total is gonna bring us up to something. We're about to find out what that something is. Uh, 48, so we have 49 more to find. I don't think we're gonna be able to do all of that in today's episode, but I'm, I'm sure as heck gonna try. There's not too much in this area as I was expecting when it comes to that. I think that we'll definitely start hounding the Hint Toad and Talk to soon enough, but I figure if these are screaming out to me so easily, I might as well take care of those first because I don't want Talk to trying to reveal the, the uh, places of these. I don't know if he can, but I don't wanna risk it. Oh, hey, look at that, there's just people here. I love it so much. Behold, the source of seafood. I mean, not exactly, <laughs> but hey, you guys believe what you wanna believe. So we gotta go up this way, where there isn't too much going on to the naked eye, and we walk past it. <laughs> uh, it's, 
this way. Uh, oh, it's on top of this tree then? Looks like it to me. Oh, I can hear it already. Um, okay, the tree disappeared for a moment. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, easy. Mighty leap from the bomb drain. Three. So now we can, ooh. Oh, we have another Koopa Trace walking. Oh, that's not good. Those are difficult as they are. Um, So how about we go ahead and get a Jaxi? That way we can go to those areas to the left because it certainly seems like there's something there. And this really clears up so much for me. I was always like, why does it seem like these areas are so open? Like there should be more there because there should be. Also, we need to change our costume. We are not well dressed for this area. We need to go and change to the Toasterini and Poncho and Sombrero because that's just a lot of fun. And then there is another costume for this area, but we certainly do not have enough for it yet. So we'll have to do that at some other time. But a lot of people have been telling me to come back to this kingdom so that we can get some moons that we missed. I've been wanting to do that, and we'll be doing that today, so it's pretty darn good. Okay. I love how crowded the Odyssey is getting, though. It's just full of so much stuff at this point. Okay, Jaxie, bring me to wherever we need to go. Excuse me. Wait, where could he be? What are you looking for? I'm traveling here with a friend, but I've lost track of him. He doesn't care for the heat, so he may be hiding in someone someone's head to cool off. Oh. Okay. What about you? Our tourists are back here in town, around the pyramid, all over. So it looks like there's a lot of tourist-related stuff we can figure out, which is pretty fun. Look at all these guys. <laughs> I have money, please take it. Sure, I'll take it. My throat is so dry, as is, as is everything else. Get in line for freezy treats. Oh, you're not talking to me. I'll give you my money, Mario, because you're Mario. Where is the Jaxie? Jaxie's over here. We're gonna grab him, and we're gonna turn around, do a U-turn, whoa! It is very difficult to do a U-turn with a Jaxie. So if we go straight ahead from here, and... Oh, hi, doggy, wait, 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 stop, stop the, stop the card! I see you, puppy. What are you looking for? Ooh, I've yet to get an actual, an actual thing from him yet. It's all just been coins, but not this time, he finally comes through for me! Found in the sand, good dog. And then he just follows me around. Don't follow me around for too long because I'm gonna be blazing off without you. Wait, he's going somewhere now. Uh, where's he going to? Oh, well, that, that's not what I wanted. I just wanted to slow down a little bit. I gotta remember that there are brakes on these things. Silly, silly me. No, no, oh gosh, I'm way back here too, come on. Well, there's several bunnies here. Oh, this might be the one I'm looking for. So we have to catch all three of them? That's really crazy. Can I like stun you or something with the hat? I never really thought about trying that. Cause they always had their own hat on. I figured they wouldn't be really that worthwhile. Okay, you know what, buddy? I'm definitely gonna have to catch all three of you. Come on, oh, you little stinker. I'm gonna get you. Oh, he's freaking out too. He's getting nervous. Like, no, I'm getting tired. It's hot out here. Oh, geez, they are so quick. Well, it's so open, like this is more difficult because it's just so open, but he's definitely getting tired. Look at him. The poor thing, I sort of feel bad. Yay, okay, he just gave me coins. I feel really bad that I made him tired. Oh, you're the, you, no, you're not bigger, you're just closer. Um, but yeah, it's really tough to keep up with him, and I think that's really our strategy. I mean, I could throw cacti at him, which I feel like is really mean, but eventually they get tired. <laughs> that's adorable. Run, little bunny, run. I mean, I hope they find it as fun as we do, and it's not like something where Mario's being really mean. Come on! Come on! Oh. It's, I don't think it's actually possible to catch up with them. Like, you just have to wait for them to get tired. There's Toon, that's one more coin. Then finally you, the last target I have. Ooh, you must be caught, bunny. Yeah, I don't think it's possible to like, actually catch him at this rate. Oh, oh, hey, oh no, they're sad! I didn't mean to do that! <laughs> I feel so bad, but hey, it gave me a moon. That's all I wanted. Thank you. Okay, uh, the only enemy is myself here. Yeah, caught hopping in the desert. I caught you. So there's one way over this way. I don't even need the Jaxie for it, I don't think. Don't tell the Jaxie that, though. You have sensitive feelings. So what is over here? Oh, okay, it's just music notes. We can do that. We can handle that just fine, unless it's a Jaxie related. Oh, it is a Jaxie related thing, ain't it? There's no way I can do this like this, I don't think. I mean, I'm gonna sure as heck try out. Okay, I'm getting the Jaxie. <laughs> this is definitely a, uh... oh, hey. Oh, too late now. Um, definitely a task for the Jax. Go for the Jaxie. Hey, buddy. Let's get you on here. And let's, uh, nope, wrong button. 
<laughs> so it's over here, and I just have to angle myself up just right, which is a very difficult thing to do with a jaxi. That is so difficult to do, I didn't even stop breaking there. That was just, the game just doesn't let you break forever. Okay, so just turn around and then try to angle myself up well. Okay, that's the best I'm gonna get for right now. Just keep it nice and straight. Uh, come on, yeah, I did it! Okay, keep moving, keep moving, don't stop. Keep going until you can't no more. Ready, yeah, okay. Taking notes, running down. So, what else do we got around here? Nothing. We can, I mean, there's no point in teleporting over. We can just walk over, because it seems as though there is a moon pipe right on over here, and there's always birds around the moon pipe, which is pretty cool. So let us go ahead and plop on down here and get at least two more, oh yeah, definitely two more moons. It's always how it is. So there's probably the last moon, because there's obviously a key here. Whoa, look at this thing. Whoa, look at how this is. This is a little crazy, I gotta say. Um, we gotta jump as well, which I'm, I'm not a big fan of, but hey, I'll do what I can. Oh geez, this is scary. I need to go down like that, and I know there's gonna be a key! Come on, there's, wait, oh, what? I had no idea what was happening there. The camera couldn't keep up. I don't really like how the camera couldn't keep up, but I mean, I tried what I could. Let's try it again. Um, so get back over there. I see where the key is, right? Okay, moving a little too quick. It's a part of that narrow platform right there. So as long as I remember, to, when we have the fork in the road, take the narrow platform, I should be just fine. Let's see if I can't get more than one, I cannot. So as long as the camera works with me here. The camera didn't really work with me before. There we go, that's much easier. All right, get this key, just like that. The problem is that I have to make my way all the way back around, I think. There we go. Oh! Okay, wait, how do I get to that one then? Hmm, I'm not sure. Yeah, okay, colossal ruins, dash and jump. No, come back. Oh boy. Oh, hey, okay, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> so we got this, that wasn't too bad at all. Sinking colossal ruins, hurry! I mean, what am, I didn't have to hurry all that much. Was it really sinking while I was doing it? Because it, it didn't really seem like it. Okay, so there's that done, that was really easy. We got one with the, the Koopa Trace walking. We got one over here that I'm not too familiar with, but we got more around here that I can adventure first. So this is uh, the Toast Arena Ruins Round Tower. So we could focus on that one first, that one shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, we're making some decent progress. How many how many moons have we gotten today? 13 minutes in or so, and we've gotten one, two, three, four, five, six, seven moons. So about a moon every other minute. So, there's one right here. And that is, yeah, right there. Okay, so, sort of went, you know, a little above and beyond for this one, literally. Into the flowing sand, cool. And then there is actually a normal moon right next to there, which is, I'm guessing, why you'd wanna do that one. They're supposed to help you find other moons maybe you didn't have an easy time finding that aren't normally a part of the game. So this next one should be like right here, right? I mean, maybe it's not like right here, right here, but down below. Oh yes, it's a music note. Okay, so if I plop down and yeah, plop down to there. Uh, Mario, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I know I said you're welcome. Uh, maybe I'm secretly pretending to be Mario. I mean, it wouldn't be much of a secret now. The secret's out, I'm pretending to be Mario. I have no idea what I'm talking about. I haven't had much of a lunch today. A zebra without a lunch, that's not much of a zebra at all. Okay, so this is gonna be a bit difficult, especially since I took a bunch of unnecessary damage. So let's grab those, I'm so scared for some reason. Grab those four, and then grab these four, and that's it. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I just gotta get, get it without getting hit. Get it, not get hit. Get it, not get hit. Oh, yay! Taking notes in the wall painting. So can I leave and teleport to a different area from here? I can, which is good, because I need to be out there. So I'm actually just gonna teleport right back up, because I think I can maybe drift there, and it looks like a pretty far out spot. Maybe I could. So where's that? That is like in this gap area, or not. Oh, it's over there, okay, that's even e easier then. Start moving. So I actually don't need to hit too much of this, because I just need to be over there. And I mean, I don't know re really how I want to do that beyond just you know making a leap of faith, I think is the best idea. This doesn't look that far. I bet you I probably should have been the gliding guy and then just jumped and glid over to it. 
but I think I can do it just as normal Mario, as long as I can. Oh, <laughs> we did it! In the skies above the canyon. I totally thought I messed that up for a good couple seconds. Oh, what is down there? Oh, oh, oh gosh, platform's wiggling. I've never been down there before. And it's clearly a hat house, so that is not exactly a moon one, but hey, if I can get it easy, I'm gonna go get it easy. Oh gosh. Uh, I'm sure there's probably more to do around here as well. I can't believe I never found that. Well, that's why we're here, to find things we didn't find before. So let me get across to this platform whenever I can, which seems to be about now. And I bet you I can use one of these, not this one, one of these sightseers to uh, see another taxi in the sky. Or maybe not a taxi this time, maybe a Sphinx. We also gotta talk to that Sphinx right there. So lots of stuff we can do around here. Moon moons and not, I'm gonna call the ones that we get through the moon rock moon moons, because that's just funny, ain't it? Funny memes. Let's go through here. And let's see what we can get done. Ooh. Um, hey buddy, it's a guy. Can we even get up this? Oh, I see. It's like one of those things where you have to memorize it and then do it. Okay, first one, not too bad. What about here? Oh, look at this, we finally got more purple coins. Uh, okay, not what I wanted. Not what I wanted either. Gosh darn it, dude, you're in my way. <laughs> you ruined my groove. Okay, well, at least we're getting tons of coins. We're back up to almost 1,400 here. So I know what to do here at the least. I could just go like that. And then, I just need you to move. So if you could just, you know, be afraid of me. Yep, be very afraid. I am a danger zebra. I guess I could have done it with my hat the entire time, but we only need 10 more purple coins, which is great. Let's get it across to you. And then, good. That is easy. Just do that. Don't try to run into the wall, though. And there's gonna be two moons, so keep an eye out for this. I'm guessing this one's gonna have moving platforms. Not yet, actually. So you just gotta pay attention to the context clues on the wall. Like if you see the spots behind us, you can see the like the X pattern wall. That's the invisible maze. But there's certainly more around here. Is that just gonna lead me out of here? I think some. Which isn't right. There's more in there for sure. I'm pretty sure. Cappy should tell us, right? Let me know. Give me the deeds, Cappy. Hmm. Oh wait. Uh, I remember this place up, but there's still one last power room. Okay, so I saw the entrance and it was a total thing. I said, hey, I haven't gone in here. And I realized that I have gone in there. That's out where I came out of. Um, Maybe something with this. Ah, there we go. I figured it out. I cracked the code. That was easy. I was just a dingus and didn't think about it. Skull sign in the transparent maze. Cool. So I'll just get out of here. Out of my way, dude. And that is another hand house completed which means we're making great progress. We're not making like 40 moons worth of progress, but we're making some great progress. We're now 51 out of 89. So maybe we might just actually be able to get lucky enough to get 40 moons here. But I need to get all the way over to the Sphinx. This guy's freaking out again, but the last time I helped him, he gave me the same moon I already had, so I'm not gonna worry about it too much now. And there's no X's over here, so it's, it has nothing to do with that. But there are some tourists around here that I wanted to say hi to. Oh, maybe this is the one that they're looking for. Amazing. Oh, you don't have a hat. Oh, no, you do. So maybe there is a tourist without a hat I can hit, and, or maybe not. Maybe I'm getting that confused. Either way. Welcome to Toasterina's main attraction, our new and improved pyramid, inverted as ever, and now floaty tune. See, it looks like Bowser did have some positive effects. Uh, so I don't need to talk to any of these guys. I, I've pretty much talked to most of those dudes. Let's go and talk to the Sphinx. Apparently, I was just in the wrong position. Oh, hello, you dude. I am no good at quizzes. What about you? You got anything to say? Oh, she's thinking. She's like, shut up, I'm thinking. Okay, I'm just gonna t stand here. Okay, this should be easy. Greetings, traveler, and to your hat as well. Can you answer my riddle? What does a thieving monster desire from this land? Ring, maracas, freezy treat, sand. He wants a ring. Yep, yep. You're correct. Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. Thank you. Have a nice day. I guess I get to talk to him some more there. Oh, ho, ho, look at this place. We are in the money. Wow, this could actually, depending on how this works, if I can just like leave this room and come back, this might be the best way to earn coins. That'd be really cool if I could. Hey, look at that, easy mode as well. Yeah, Sphinx's treasure bone. Let's try that again. Let me just try to leave 
and come back in. Do the coins come back? Cause that, oh my gosh, I'd be able to get 99.99 in a flash. I mean, I don't know if I wanna do that. I feel like it's a little too, okay, they're gone. But if I died, I'd lose 10 coins and then I could come back in and that actually probably still would be a really easy way to farm it up. I do hear the shimmering of a moon around here though. I heard it for just a moment. And it sounded like it was like maybe up above. I am curious as to why there's like a little dip here. You see that? Ooh, 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 hey, I found it, look at me. Okay, now it's just a normal moon. Hidden room in the flowing sands, cool. Well, there I go, being an adventurer, thinking about things in an adventurous way. Ooh, look at me getting up here too. So, where should I skedaddle to now? There's just places all over the place, but maybe we should start back here at the uh, Toasterina Northwest, Northwest Reaches. There is like a little trophy thing here. Is this a Koopa race? Oh, this might be a Koopa race, that'd be cool. Cause it seems like there's a Koopa race in every kingdom at this point. Yeah, okay. Let's go do it, wait, what do you guys have to say? I'm chilling in the shade. Yeah, me too. Ow, cause I have a sombrero, I'm always shady. <laughs> okay, so, hi. We're the roving racers, we rove the globe and blah, 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 I'm in. That's a blah, 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 blah. Awesome. So, this shouldn't be too bad. Koopa free running, and kingdom regular. Oh, it's nighttime now, so we gotta be on a jaxi. Oh, that is so cool, but also a little concerning. Okay, so where's the jaxi? He's way over there. So, we just need to roll over there real quick. Um, That's not what I wanted. Go, 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 go. I'm not in first anymore. Oh, maybe it's like first one to get the jaxi just gets it, or maybe they all have jaxis. So if I wiggle the controller, that doesn't really help me too much. I was hoping maybe it would give me another speed boost. How am I in third? I don't see anybody in front of me. They do all get their own jaxis down. Maybe somebody took a different path I'm not aware of, but I feel like this is still the best path. Oh gosh, tight turn, tight turn. Yeah, it still says I'm in second. Okay, there we go, about time. Yeah, I don't see what I could really do here beyond just Ride the Jaxi straight over there. Like, how can I cut out, cut out some time here? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, uh, yeah, maybe if I cut straight through the center of the town next time, that might be a bit better. Hey, okay, 38 seconds. I know I could do better if I can find a better route, which might be where the gold coop helps us out. Blazing fast, bro, here's a prize power moon. Okay, so there's one power moon. We got another one to go though, Sand Kingdom regular come. So we're doing pretty good. All right then, talk to you again. Hey, we've got a new racer. You'll win something good too if you win the race, up for it? Yep, yep. All right, Mr. Gold Koopa, huh? We'll deal with it, not a problem, easy. Koopa free running, Sand Kingdom Master Cup. I feel like, well, another thing would be cool is if they just did more races like this. Like, you know, like if they, I was talking about DLC, was it that, this episode? No, that was last episode. <laughs> Maybe that was this episode, I can't remember anymore. It's been a bit of a blur. Okay, so, oh wow, so he's just like, I guess they aren't in a jacksie, he's just glowing. Hmm, he's catching up, but he ain't. Okay, maybe it really is just about cutting corners and just being as good of a runner as you can be. But I think that if I cut right through the town, I think I could actually run straight into it and not have to deal with hopping off of it because of how tight that turn is. Yes, 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 this is it, this is it, and we got it, cool. Yeah, he was way far behind. That was 3382, so we got like a whole five seconds better there. Good. So there we go, there's our second one, another power moon for us. I will gladly take it. Sand Kingdom Master Cup. What else do we have around here? Because I'm certain that we do. There's one right at the edge over here. What will that be? Oh, it's you. You're freaking out. Are you okay, buddy? Whoa! <laughs> Hi. Oh. Who put up these posters? They're an eyesore littering up the place. Oh, I can help with that. There we go. Ooh. Yeah, now, especially since the wedding is already over. <laughs> it's a little too late for these. I feel like these weren't here before, but maybe they weren't. Ooh. Well, it isn't too bad to get them. It's just a matter of uh, spending the time to do it, you know? Instead of that guy who's just freaking out about it. You know, sometimes you gotta go ahead and solve a problem. You know, you can't just freak out and let somebody else do it. You gotta get down and dirty. There's that one. This one shouldn't be too bad, I just need to do that. Okay, well, if I did it correctly, that was. Okay, hold on, no. <laughs> How can I get this? Maybe I could actually just, oh, wait. Yeah, can I get on this little up? I guess I can. Okay, that worked, <laughs> I just headbutted it away. 
You know, I want to suggest that to solve your problems is to headbutt things away, but in this situation, it did work. Okay, so there were more purple coins here that I got at some point. Here, um, I'm trying to just get up here. So that way I can face this way and do that, and then, oh, there we go. Okay, so let me, darn it, that wasn't quite what I wanted. So let's try that again. This is so difficult, but at the same time, rewarding if we can do it. Yes, okay, that's all of them. Cool, that was a nice little move at the end too. Awesome, awesome, so let's go ahead and do, oh, man. He said, wow, thanks for something, thanks for cleaning it up for me probably or something. Let's see, you gonna say it again? Oh, thanks for cleaning that up. Yep, I was right. So there's one at the very edge over here. Oh, hey. <laughs> so it looks like we don't even need a Goomba Tower for her. We just need a Goomba. Where would there be a Goomba? Back here. Ah, yes, okay, so we'll have to do that in a moment. In the meantime, how can we get over on that? I bet you, if we, hmm. I bet you if we go on the electrical thing, we might be able to do that. Is there a quick way on top of this building? Oh, probably from this. Yeah, this definitely seems to be the case. So if we go like, oh, that's totally makeable. If we go like, oh, that didn't quite work. I'm still trying to figure that part out. There we go, see, that wasn't too bad at all. Just had to get the right angle. So if I go like this, ooh, and then get up like that, and then, oh, wait, wait. Oh, uh, yeah, no, wait, okay, I got it. <laughs> On the north pillar. I'm sure I could have glided here, maybe, but that worked, so I'm not gonna complain. We got two more there, one more there. And so if I have to do all that, I will. First, let's just get the Goomba here. I feel like this is gonna be a super time-consuming thing. I don't know where there's any other Goombas either, so I think it's just, you know, walking on over here. So let's go ahead and grab you, and then grab you. I could make it a tower, but there's no use in it. It just needs to be one singular Goomba. Excuse me, guys, I'm Mario Goomba, Goombarion. That's another character, actually. Oh yeah, can I make my way across here, or is this just a pit? I sure hope so, because I'm dedicating myself to it. Oh no, darn it. <laughs> so you gotta make the long way around. I don't appreciate that, but I, sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do. Along the, or along the long way, something. We're going the long way, that's all I'm trying to say. And there's another moon over there. Okay, that's a pretty easy one. It's just chilling out over there. Um, I don't know if I'm doing the best thing by going there. I probably should just go on the ground here. I feel like there's ah, too much action, too many threats happening here. If I just sneak around, Operation Run Goomba Run. I just like how we could be a Goomba wherever we want, you know? That was sort of my worry, especially when we first got the T-Rex. If you go too far with the T-Rex, Cappy times out. And I sort of got nervous that that's just how it was gonna be for everything, is that you can't wear everything forever. Luckily, that hasn't been the case, and um, you can, like most things, you can just be for as long as you want, as long as you need to, and, and that's really cool and really fun, so I'm glad to see that. Especially for a Goomba, you know, you can just play this whole kingdom as a Goomba as, as long as you want, or as long as you can, really. There are some places maybe you won't be able to go or do things that the Goomba can do, so you'll have to leave the Goomba behind at that point. But beyond that, can we walk up this as a Goomba? Look at Goomba go. He's a Goomba boy. Are we going the right way? Yeah, we gotta go all the way to the edge here. Just hasn't appeared on screen yet. Oh, look at that. There's certainly something here with that cactus, so we'll we'll come back for that. But for now, I gotta keep running this way, keep running this way, keep the, keep the, keep the, keep running this way. Oh, run. <laughs> Whittle waddle. I don't care how you get there. It's just traversing land that takes so long as a Goomba. He's like, oh, my love. Beautiful Goomba. Yeah. Okay, so there's that, and we get it. Thank you. Love at the edge of the desert. Okay, I don't mean to break up young love, but <laughs> that was awful. Why'd I do that? I feel really bad. I'm gonna, whoa. Go and figure out this cactus, see what we can get. Ooh. Can I break this cactus? Maybe I can't. I mean, maybe if I break off his friends, he'll be like, no. It just explode, or maybe I could just throw my hat on it. Wait, or not? Hmm. What if I run a Jaxie into it? That might be the answer. Let me go get another Jaxie. We'll run right into it, and that'll probably be it. I mean, if the cactus, if the Jaxie, Jaxie can't run over a cactus, then I'll be a little concerned about his abilities and how much of stone he's actually made of. The problem is that it's just very easy to make a mistake 
back close to the edge. Well, we're doing it. Ooh. Oh, hey, that worked, cool. <laughs> Mario looks so silly at this angle. Okay, let's go get it. See, we're almost at 700 coins now. We weren't making many coins the last two episodes because I've just been dying so much. There hasn't been too many coins to collect in the Cap and Cascade Kingdom, but Sand Kingdom's a whole lot different. There's tons of coins again. So, there's two over on that side. And I mean, there's no really way to get on top of the pyramid itself. I'm actually surprised by that. I thought there was a flag up there, but I guess we could take the uh, slingshot if we needed to. And, and then there's stuff down below. I'm really not sure if there'll be anything moon-wise down below. Oh gosh, don't fall down, please. I don't want, no! I didn't want to do this. You know what, fine, I'm just going here. <laughs> Jeez. All right, so I'm just gliding, guy. Let's see what we can get here. I see one, you know, okay, I can't control my camera here, which I really don't like about this whole thing. Oh wow, look at this! Oh hey, this is for New Dong City! Has this been here the entire time? Wow, can't believe I missed this. All right, we're gonna skip this, even though it's really funny with him in the sombrero. Whoa! All right, let's skip it. It's just so silly, I love it. But, um, cool. Look at that. So we get the isolated rooftop, and we get this moon for New Dong City. Secret path to New Dong City. Cool, cool, cool. That's probably where that one moon I've been missing in Sand Kingdom is, is I believe there is a Sand Kingdom moon that's like way high up, and I think it's one of these painting things. So, um, Obviously. Oh, that reminds me. We still haven't gone into the painting in Cascade Kingdom that's probably available now. We should do that really soon. Um. Yeah, I just now thought about that. So, yeah, there's that there. and That's like a moon in a box, maybe? It looks like it. But that's not like a, oh. Hmm. That's not a box that can normally break, right? That's not, I have to be like a bullet bill for that, right? Now, I've never been up there. There's still a flagpole I have yet to get up there. Oh. Okay, I got up here, no problem. But you cannot break it like that. And I already got that hawk for sure. Oh, and there is a, uh, a moon pipe here. So we'll handle the moon pipe. This one's pretty darn far out, but I guess I just sort of wanted to fill this space because there wasn't too much going on. All right, oh. oh. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> I try not to, but sometimes it's impossible. So it is crazy how much post-game content there is in this. I really do enjoy it, but it's just not what I was expecting. Okay, so can I become you? Of course I can. Oh, it's frozen water too, so you can't do this without him. All right, let's go. Heading on up, going to the right. So where am I supposed to go and where am I not supposed to go? Uh, So far, it looks like I haven't missed anything. I gotta be careful though. That isn't so pleasant. Hmm. Oh, okay, so look at this. This is, oh, oh, this is not the right way for sure. Like, it doesn't feel like it, especially since the camera's not really working the best for me, but we got it. Right at the end, we lost our little friend. Freezing water away, hidden room. Don't don't be shooting water at me. That's not, not pleasant. So we can go this way, plop down like that, like gravity do its thing. These guys have such a Splatoon feel to them. All right, uh, okay, there's no goop at the end, that's good. I was worried that there would be goop at the floor here. There is not them, which is good to know. There's a couple more coins, so we should be able to go through this pro probably pretty quickly, because I don't think we've had any purple coins in the moon pipes, which is good. I mean, it's also bad, because we still have 10 more coins to find that I just can't find anywhere. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, I probably should've just kept going. I don't know if I would've made it, but you know, it would've been worth a try. Oh, now I'm back at the beginning, come on. You really don't get too much, but hey, I made it. Okay, you don't get too much water for that last part, for the freezing water wine. So let me uh, hop out of you, don't need you no more, sorry. And we're good to go. We have, we've been getting a lot of moons, we've gotten over 20 so far. Once again, not quite 40, but we still have a good chunk of today's episode to get through things. So I don't know about that one, that one's really confusing me. This one's relatively easy. So let's get back here. There might even be a Jaxi calling thing here. Because if there is, that's great. Because then we can just charge over there, grab the moon super duper easy. I like the music. <laughs> uh, well then that's a Jaxi statue. Oh, hey, hey buddy, how you doing? Exactly what I wanted to see. So if we just charge you right on over, I don't see how we can't just grab it. Yeah, it looks fine. Ready, boom. Oh, look at this, there's also a, uh, 
thing here. This, that was Island in the Poison Swamp. There's also one of these. Oh my. So I think I wanna do this as a Jaxi. Maybe I can cheat a little bit. Um, Break. There we go. And then, yeah, I could totally cheat this. Totally cheat it. <laughs> Sorry. Sand Kingdom Time Returns. Maybe I was supposed to do that, but it, honestly, it's hard to tell. Oh, I'm sorry, Jaxi, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so I gotta get up here. For sure. Like, hmm, I'm trying to think of my options here. If I capture you, I can definitely get across to there if I didn't mess that up. I think I might have to try it again. Yeah, I'm just gonna try it again right away, because that was wrong. I should be able to get to the top of that. I don't think there's any other way to do it, right? This is pretty obvious that there isn't. Be never known. <laughs> just always hanging out here. So, jump, jump. Oh, that is so weird every time. We might not actually make it. I mean, I might be able to make it close enough that I can just hop out of him. But we're not, we're making it, okay. I underestimated you, sir. I'm so sorry. So here we can hit this, and this will give me a moan. Go. Cool. The, the treasure of Jaxi ruins. And then what about this one? Some coins, cool. So we can call a Jaxi up here for whatever reason. I'm more interested in, I wish there was a way to get this guy up there. I mean, maybe there's another of them up there. But what if we like, ah, oh, that doesn't work, okay. I know there are bullet bills here, but how in the world could we, I don't think we could. I mean, hey, well, what's, what's the harm in trying, right? Oh, hey, you weren't here before. You're new. You're not a moon one, but you're new. Maybe I should try that out really quickly. <laughs> I know, I run into one moon. I try to go do one moon, I run into eight more, but that's just this game. You can't blame me for that one. Let us get across to you. And how many do we need? Probably only like three. Let's get you. Oh gosh, you're chasing me. I want you to chase me, but not now. Well, that'll probably, be, ooh, that might be what we have to do is have them chase us like super far out and then try it. We have four Goombas here, a four stack Goomba. Jump over, oh my gosh. <laughs> not what I wanted. Oh boy. Big jump. Uh, yes, okay, I dodged it, but you're coming back around. Please don't be mean to me. Run, run. And then, hey, how you doing? There you go, that worked. You definitely weren't here before. But you know what, that's sort of the nature of the game. Is that things come back, new things show up. So there's more than one of her in this one. Love in the heart of the desert. Okay, two more moons, and so we're at 30 for today's episode. So what if I could, hmm. Not what I wanted exactly, <laughs> I can say that much. Also, we never checked the plants that grew back at the center of the town. I'll check those soon too. Lots to do in Sand Kingdom. Like, well, well, I'm trying to get to all of it. There's just, it's impossible to not be scatterbrained at this game, which is both a beautiful thing and also sort of a crazy frustrating thing. So if this, these guys over here, if you could keep chasing me. Um, over to here. Okay, yeah, you kept going there pretty well. And then you're just gonna run right into it if I do that. So let me do that. And then, well, gosh darn it, I'm the worst, ugh. I gotta be able to make that, right? I mean, maybe I'm looking at this all wrong. Maybe I can just charge right over, but for some reason I just doubt it. So I'm gonna jump, no, not like actually jump on you, I wanted to jump over you. All right, come on, whoop, and then capture you. Oh, come on, buddy, really? And then, yep, yep, okay, so it's way over there, holy cow. I don't think this is gonna work. I'm accelerating. It doesn't even feel like I'm accelerating. Wow, we got pretty close down, but not close enough, and I was accelerating the entire time there. I don't think there's any other bullet bill shooters. I, I can't really imagine any other ones, or remember any other ones. Maybe I'm doing this wrong, but I wanna give it a good couple shots. Because it doesn't seem impossible, that's for sure. It just seems very difficult. Like, maybe I could become Yoon and then like get another one to follow me, and then like hop out of you. You can just keep going, I guess. Oh, here you are. And then, wait, wait, no, yes, yes. Oh, this might be it. This might be it. Come on, come on. Oh, I'm getting a little off center here. Oh no. Oh, what? Are you kidding me? That can't be right. There's no way. Holy cow. 
I know, I know, come on! Oh, it's not possible. There is no way that is what I do. That is, if, if so, that is like probably the most difficult moon so far I've found in the game. Because what the heck, what do you do there? There's no way, I don't know of any other bullet bill. I'm so close, it's almost like it's like trying to tell me it's not it with how close it lets me get, you know? But I, just, I don't want to give up, for whatever reason, it just feels very foreboding to give up. Maybe if I start from up here instead, but then it's just, that happens. You can't actually get them. Well, what if I, here, stand here. And, and then, no, that's not gonna work. That is not gonna work. Like, even if I hit him, that's not any farther than it normally is down. Like, that's the problem, is that this isn't gonna get me any farther. Yeah, it definitely isn't. That can't be it. I have no clue what it is, but that's not it. There's no way. What do you have to say? You can warp around, you know? Yep, yep, I already know all about that. So, I wanna go and talk to the Tracing Koopa again. I'm not looking forward to this challenge either, but I think this is something I can do if I try really hard. And also, I think that there is a picture thing around here. I remember, if I actually, I should probably go take a look at it. If we take a look at our pictures, where is the one that I'm thinking of? It's, is it not here? I swear I took a picture of it. I did, but I was a dingus and took a picture of it the wrong way. Um, if you go forward from him facing the back of him. Okay, so. I guess what it's trying to say, well, he always faces you, so that doesn't actually help contextually. Yeah, actually, he, he always faces you. So that doesn't help at all. So I'm looking for like a set of three bushes. This is the first one I've seen. I mean, maybe it's just super duper specific where you have to land. Maybe it's a little bit farther out. I figured it'd be like around here. But maybe that's not it. Maybe there is another group of three bushes. Maybe it's actually a farther set of paces away. But it's one of these groups of bushes, but it, I think it's a group of three. I don't see any other group of three. So I'm pretty sure it's that one. I don't know. This game can be silly sometimes. We just found that out with the bull bill scenario. Um, those are just two over there. That's just one. So I think it's this one. I'm gonna try like one more time. Nope. Okay. Talk to you. Hey dude, are you up for a challenge? Everyone loves walking, right? Problem is they don't take it seriously. That's what trace walking is all about. You're back and you're in luck. I scored a new prize to give away. Wanna give it a shot? Sounds fun. Okay, sweet. Let's do what we can do. And the rules are, of course, just walk around. So some people's criticism with me doing this um, is that I kept on using the run button. My defense for the run button, 90 points, jeez. Um, my defense for using the run button is that this disappears eventually. And it's like, if I run, I can keep it on screen for longer. I mean, I guess not run button. I don't know why I say run button, but I mean like you can use the joystick to go slower, but it like, ugh. Okay, let, that'll do, let's see. You'll need 90 points, this is definitely not 80 points though, it's pretty close. Uh, keep up, keep your mustache up, my man, you'll get it next time. So let's try again. I don't like how I have to talk to him to try again, like it should just uh, give me an option to try again, but I guess not, you know, that's fine. Um, ready? I mean, maybe if I just try with just the right momentum. Like maybe, you know, if I do it just right, Nah, it's not right. Totally, yes, like that's sort of the thing. It's like without actually being able to see it, it won't work. 72, yeah, that was worse. So I think I need to run full speed. I just need to find the right camera angle. Like I need to slowly rotate the camera. I think that's like really what it relies on for this one since it's just such a perfect circle is that you just need to find the right way to rotate the camera. Cause you think you got it and then you just don't, you know? <laughs> it's always that last corner that I cut too tight, but hey, that was pretty good. Let's see what we get. 86, yikes, come on. I was so close. I took some of the obvious parts a little too overboard. Do it one more time, I got it this time. It's all mine, it's all mine. I was like how Jaxie just hangs out there. <laughs> He's just there. Let's go. Come on. 
Like, I'm cutting this too tight, I'm mean, too wide, when it's right in front of my face. Oh, that was not a 90. That was literally anything but. It's so difficult. 89, are you kidding me? That was 89. That is not true. <laughs> that was worse than the time before. One more time. Ready? Go. I wonder if it counts, you know, being inside the circle worse than being outside, I mean, better than being outside of it. Certainly feels that way. Ugh. So bad. So bad. And that one still wasn't too bad. Is it the first half of the circle definitely is more important than the second half. So if I could just get the second half not awful, I'd be fine. That was probably not that great. I still cut it too short. I felt like I was cutting it way too wide. But apparently 96, hey, okay. Awesome. That was that walk was serious business. Boom, the, this power moon is yours. Good, good, good. Yeah, more walking in the desert. One more until we're at 30. So that's you done. And it's just this one. This one's staring me right in the face. Oh no, the one over here. Okay, we'll get that one done, and then I'll start talking to Hint Toad, and I'll start talking to talk to, and hopefully they can help me out a bit here, because I'm struggling. I'm straight struggling. Uh, so it's right over there. It actually is probably up there then? It looks like it's on a pillar of some sort. So let me try up here as just normal Marion. I don't really need to be... It's not this pillar, but it's the next pillar, it seems. Oh, maybe I need to hit that P block. Because right now there ain't much here. Oh, no, okay, I just hit the butt slam. <laughs> An invisible gleam. I didn't even see the gleam. It's way too bright here. What is this P block doing? Oh, hey! Oh, and the key's right there. Whoa! <laughs> did I really just do that? I guess it did. Almost have 2,000 coins again though, which is nice. I need to check out the shop, but I still need to find those. I'm definitely, before the end of today's episode, I need to find the rest of those coins, you know? It's just, this area is so huge. There's so many places it could be. It's mind boggling. I just got so much more I can do. I, I think it's, why am I going this way? I don't know, it might have to be actually something I saved till another episode, but I do want to explore this area a tiny bit more. So let me just take a, a right angle here, and then context clues, you know? Just go right, right at that area. No, wrong button. Hup, hup, yep, okay. Oh gosh, and came to timer challenge, tune. I did three, I don't remember doing one, but I might have done one a while ago. I just wanna look off the edge here, because I feel like if there maybe be more purple coins, there might be some more hanging out around here that I just haven't seen yet. But that doesn't seem to be the case. You know, like I missed that one hat house right over there, and that sort of kept me on edge for now, until then. But I don't see too much. I don't see too many purple coins like at all anywhere, so. 90 out of 100, I'm still missing 10, and we're really close. Like, we're, I mean, we're getting this. He's out of 89, so we're about, 20 away, 21? I mean, that's still a lot. Like, it's a very jam-packed area. But we got all the moon moons, except for that last one, the malarkey one. So I think we're good to go back. Here, I still really wish there was a uh, purple coin finding machine or something, maybe for like a lot of money, maybe for like 99, 99 coins. I was gonna say maybe if we find all the purple coins, but then it wouldn't be useful now, would it? Uh, let's go inside. Hello, anybody home? I'm sure there is. Hello. Uh, so what do you have? Hey, 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 got some new stuff in. You do indeed, you do have the Wario Claws. I thought you did, and I was correct. So that's not too much, there's only 200 coins. Oh, I didn't want to change now. <laughs> uh, the kind of outfit that makes you want to wash at least once before you wear it. And after, probably, or more than once for sure after. Okay, so you have some stuff that I can't afford. Just that, you know, if we get the 10 more coins, we're good. Ay, ay, ay. I mean, I haven't worn the other suit that you can get around here, have I? And that's the cowboy hat. So maybe we should wear that around. Maybe that'll actually give us some opportunities to do some other things, I'm not really sure. And where's the second piece? Cowboy outfit, cool. Cowboy Mario, I like it. Cool. <laughs> it looks so cool. Okay, so these are all grown, which is awesome. Do you know about Amiibo, right? Just about any time you can, yeah, I know, I know. Something good will happen, you'll see. What about this? Oh, hey, do they each give me a moon? 
Wow, look at that, I wasn't expecting. Desert gardening, ruined seed. What about this one? Yeah, they all give me a moon. Desert gardening, seed on the cliff. I thought that maybe once we grow them all, the guy will come back and he'll be happy and he'll be like, hey, you grew my garden, here's a one moon, but we get three moons out of that. Cool, so we might actually be able to reach that 40 quid. I mean, I only have like three or four minutes left of this episode, so probably not, but hey, I'm trying my best. So now that I've done that, they can't waste my time with those kind of uh, talk to stuff. So let's see. Wandering cactus. Okay, what else do you got for me? Hidden room in the inverted pyramid. Okay. Another one. Found with sand kingdom art. Okay, that one is the one I'm having a hard time with. And then wandering cactus again. Okay, so he's just gonna tell me again and again. These three, I'm gonna assume. So let's go to the hint toad. There's not gonna be, oh, you're new. Oh, look at you, you're gonna be the guy who's like, hey, I got the music or something, and then you gotta get some music. Hello, I'm looking for some music that fits this theme. The theme is, wait for it, memories of a tough battle. If you got that one, let me hear it. Tough battle, huh? Uh. Which one would have been, like the battle, Bowser Battle One. Let's do this one. Um. Yes, this is it. Okay, this is the music I wanted to hear. Thank you. Here is here. This is for you. Yay! Okay, that was an easy moon as well. Jamming in the Sand Kingdom. I mean, I might be able to get the 40 moon mark. You can check out the music list anytime. And I feel like I hear the shimmering of another moon. It's fun to travel around while listening to your favorite music. It's hard to hear now over this really loud music, so I would like to put an end to it. Uh, music list. Okay, there's like no way to turn it off sometimes. Maybe if I left and came back? I swear I heard the shimmering of a moon now, so this is really frustrating me. Uh, let me go into a building. Okay, help me on. Having trouble finding power moons? I can help you out for 50 coins. Wanna buy a hint? Of course, I'm showered in coins right now. Thanks, I marked it on your map with minus, so. Way over there, that's probably the hidden room in the uh, the inverted pyramid. Let's see what else, wanna buy a hint? Thanks, I marked down your map, and this is going to be way over there. Oh, that's the painting one, yep. Or no, maybe? Having trouble finding power moons, it can help you out, wanna buy a hint? Thanks, I marked down your map. Okay, so that one's, thought I already did that one. Guess there's another one there. Got any more for me? Cause I'll buy them. Uh. Yeah, there's definitely more stuff in the inverted pyramid. So we got much more to do here in the Sand Kingdom that we will have to worry about very soon, but I think with that, that is all I'm gonna worry about in today's episode of Super Mario Odyssey. If you watch this part of video, make sure you comment. Cowboy Zebra, so I know you've watched at the end and that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.